Hi, my name is Jeroen Hopper from the Clapham Property Blog and I'm going to show you around my Laytona Road project. Right, so here we go. Uh, this is a brilliant project actually. I sourced this at a, a discounted price through an agent, mind you. Um, and this will be a four to five bedroom conversion. So. I'm going to take you around the flat now and show you the ins and outs. Uh, we're just in the demolition phase now, so everything is stripped out and ready to be re-plumbed, rewired, and so on and so forth. So hold on to your hats and here we go. Right, well I'll start you off with the, uh, the hallway. Uh, as you can see, there's not much of it left. Literally everything's been smashed to pieces. So uh, over here to the left, we have the kitchen, or again, what's left of it. Uh, there's not actually much. Uh, for a change, I'm not actually going to change the, uh, the layout in this property. Uh, we're actually going to keep the living room here, uh, which is nice and bright, as you can probably tell. Uh, so we're going to have a little bit of a dining area here, and a sort of TV area there, and so on and so forth. So it'll be a nice living come dining area. Here we've got the smallest bedroom of the bunch. Now this actually, this is an interesting story actually, this used to be a balcony which has been filled in. So now we've got another sort of annex here. This used to be a storage room. So the previous owner actually, he bought this from the council and has now made this into an extra room. So um, the only Tricky bit for us is this dividing wall, but we need to keep that because that's structural. So we're going to build in some wardrobes here on the side, and this is just about big enough for a double bed. So go, going to go on upstairs, have a look at what's happening there. Now again, this is uh, one of the perks of having a big upstairs flat. Uh, this is an extra room which was actually located above the communal staircase. So good size room which has already been plastered and it was actually bigger but what I've done here is I've had the guys build another shower room. So very useful to have the five bedroom property of course and um, to have an extra shower room also. So uh, deciding where the dividing wall was going to go. It was actually quite simple um, because you can see there's a natural divide there by the windows. So we took that. We actually made this alcove here as well. Again, it's very good for storage. Works very well there. Let me take around the rest of the property. So we've seen two of the bedrooms so far and a shower room. This is the bathroom. You can see everything is being ripped out. Separate loo. And here we've got three very good size double bedrooms, which also will be decorated to, of course, a high standard. So, we'll build in some wardrobes over here. Show you the last bedroom. Right, and there we go. 